Hello everyone. I want to say thank you for stopping by my video. My name is Isaac and I'm a D4 in Nebraska. If you're anything like me, you've occasionally felt frustrated that dental school wasn't always preparing you for the next step in being a private practice dentist. And it's this frustration that kind of motivated me to go beyond the classroom in an attempt to prepare myself during this dental school time to be the best dentist I could possibly be. Today, I'm going to show you five educational resources that I found during my time in dental school that are completely free and have greatly improved my clinical knowledge and skill set. I hope you enjoy my list. Number one is Dental Town. Dental Town has been around for a while now, but it seems fewer and fewer new dentists know about it. Dental Town is a great place to ask questions and learn from more experienced dentists. By far, the best part of Dental Town for dental students is the continuing education portion of the website. Topics in this section range from oral surgery to ergonomics to practice management and even more. Each presenter is asked by Dental Town to create a lecture so that we as students are at a lower risk for trusting bad information. Additionally, each lecture generally costs $36 to view, but with a student account, the fee is waived and nearly every lecture can be viewed at no cost. That's hundreds of hours of normally paid CE you can receive for completely free. It normally takes a few days to get a Dental Town account. But once activated, I highly recommend going to the endodontics section in the message boards area and reading and watching all the pinned posts. Number two, the clinician's report. In dental school, we spend a lot of time talking about the different dental materials and their properties. We spend almost no time talking about the specific dental brands that can be purchased. This is where the clinician's report comes in. Gordon Christensen's monthly publication is an evidence-based report comparing specific dental products to each other. Each report costs between $30 and $50, but as long as you're a student, you can receive a free clinician's report every month until graduation. I have a binder where I keep every clinician's report I have received, so I can look back whenever I'm talking to a sales rep. Number 3. CDOCS.com Same-day crowns are getting more and more popular, but schools have been slow to adopt and fully integrate this technology. CEREC is the most popular same-day crown system so I made it a priority in dental school to be able to effectively and independently use a CEREC machine upon my graduation. The official website for CEREC information is cdocs.com, and a membership to this website runs from $99 to $689 a month. However, if you are a dental student, you are able to get a free membership until graduation. cdocs.com has a lot of great educational videos, but where I really found it helpful was under the CEREC Case Analysis tab it is under this tab that members post cases they are having trouble with and ask the experts to help them work through the issues. To practice my own problem solving, I would download the RST files from the website and attempt to find and correct the error using a CEREC machine at my school. I would then compare my solution to the solution posted by the expert. This methodology quickly developed my skills using the CEREC Crown Design software. Number four, Facebook dental groups. Facebook these days is mostly for middle-aged people, but most of the best dentists happen to also be middle-aged people, so there is no better place to find dental experts than Facebook. There are many private Facebook groups that cover all types of dentistry, so you will definitely be able to find a group that interests you. Now, the best part about these groups is that the people posting are usually just normal people like you and me, and if you ask a question to a group member, they are frequently happy to respond and share their knowledge. Two groups I particularly enjoy are the Dental Clinical Pearls group and the Dental 3D Printing group. Number five, YouTube. Of course YouTube is gonna make an appearance on this list. There is no greater repository of collective wisdom than YouTube. With that being said, I must caution you that much of the information posted here can be bad or highly biased. So it's important to take everything you hear with a pinch of salt. I highly recommend a few channels including Real World Endo, Dr. Baron Grutter, and the Glidewell Lab YouTube page. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you're able to check out some of these resources while they're still free. If you found any other educational resources that have helped you during your time in dental school, please link them below. I hope you have a wonderful day. Have a great time out there.